What is up, everybody, and welcome to yet another stream. Tis I, Shad Gamer, coming to you from Glorious Shadville. And tonight is going to be one of those infamous stream slash videos that I'm going to crop out the first part of this to uh, kind of talk about Honeyland and then switch over into some Modern Warfare 2 gameplay. Um, yeah, I haven't talked about Honeyland in a little bit uh, i've been just playing the alpha version beta is it alpha um for some time now and i love it, it it's just fun to get into um on a day-to-day -day basis you know harvest hunt do whatever needs to be done uh upgrade my bees it's etc etc et so it's uh it, it's still good i i still love the game and um if you watched one of my previous videos, I did mention that uh, I was actually so excited by one of the releases from Corey that uh, I took some stuff off of the market to sell uh, and actually turn around and tried buying some stuff. No, I didn't want to actually pay what they were asking, but uh, but I did put some offers in and we'll wait and see. So I'm trying to actually grow the hive as opposed to, you know, shedding some of the bees that uh, that i've got to end items so anyhow that being said still bullish on the project Corey did release a another video i believe it was yesterday maybe the day before anyway about the recent and upcoming uh events and those are going to be pretty big the first one being the ido that information i think he said was going to be coming out um there's going to be a space or a chat or something coming out soon and then yeah I'm, I'm doing a real good uh job of being the ambassador for <laughs> for some of this information however you can always check out uh, the video i'll leave a link for it in the description below um so there's the ido coming out there's a hive mine which is going to be um for staking everything and then i guess you're going to be able to actually visually go in and check for stats and bees and then actually contact owners to say hey yo i like your bee uh, let's discuss some sort of deal which was news to me that, that sounds like a pretty cool idea uh so that is going to be coming out i believe he said on the weekend and again double check his video in the link below um and then the other of course is going to be the actual release towards the end of march mid-march end of march so the next six weeks five six weeks is going to be huge i can't wait uh i'm super pumped i can't wait to see what they come out with especially when it comes to the hive mind um the audio is obviously going to be pretty important there's of course the distribution for uh the people who were staking uh last summer ish uh and then again for the alpha testers they're going to get a portion of uh, a token drop as well. So just be aware if you haven't been, you know, testing or playing it, you might want to check them out. Uh, actually, I don't know if the snapshot has been taken yet or not, but you could always jump into their discord and verify if there's still time to be part of that, uh, that million token drop. So for the testing portion of it of course the the staking portion it was long done that snapshot i believe was done in uh october september october if i'm not mistaken anyhow still bullish on the project definitely definitely do check them out they're always updating they're always giving us information and Corey, justin um i have been uh, i've stepped away from the discord um and trying to kind of get away from that as a whole unfortunately it is one of the key ways to get information get alpha um i did actually jump in there to suggest that you know for for onboarding and for new people coming into web3 that it might be a good idea to not only provide the update and news information in discord but also to somehow push it to um, a section a new section within the game hopefully they uh they take a look at that and you know try and implement something because i think it's going to be pretty a pretty good idea for them to do that if they're looking to onboard non-web threeers who just kind of want to stay in touch and up to date with what's going on in the game it's it's going to be there's a lot of stuff it's not a simple pick up and go it is but if you want to maximize um 
what you do in the game you definitely want to learn everything about it how things work uh together um and how to just avoid you know pitfalls and mistakes of combining the wrong types of bees together anyhow i could go on and on love you Corey. love honeyland um and, and i can't wait i did just see actually speaking of honeyland their community always been there and, and just top notch again i've stepped away for for the last i'd say almost month um but i did see one member showing a picture of some hail out in la i'm gonna be out in la santa monica next week for a couple days and i really hope that kind of stuff stays or comes before we get there uh because i've got uh, enough of that that i deal with here uh north of the border so yeah la trader is the is the individual who posted that picture so man i i do hope that's you know snow sleet uh hail that is all worked out and gone before we actually get there uh next thursday so if anybody's around uh santa monica area and wants to uh get together from either honeyland or you know just from this uh i'm always good to grab a local pint somewhere so let me know anyway that's it for the video side of things thank you so much for joining this i'm on twitch at shack gamer 80 uh and i try to stream monday wednesday thursday evenings between 7 and 8 ish and then again on saturday mornings between 8 and 9 30 a.m so yeah feel free to check me out there you can hit me up on twitter at shack gamer 80 and on to the next one as always stay healthy stay safe a lot of love i'm